one of the most beautiful landscapes in the world. It is such a magic area. Wonderful woods and streams and hillsides, some that, I mean, I used to look over one, a Gromont, and I knew the other side of it. If you continued on, you'd see the sea. That was kind of magic to me. And that is one of the wonderful things about our valley. We're not very far away from anywhere. Um, but at the same time, it has an intimacy, a wildness, a drama if you take places like Fryupdale. I long to have come back to it whenever I'm away. If I'm in total control, I produce rubbish. Banal, drab, nothingness. It's when I release control, when I can you know, let go. And it's a terrifying experience. It's, it's sort of like going down a toboggan run and letting go of the controls, letting some outer force take charge. What you've got to do is make the art that you make correspond with the way that you feel so that it becomes an extended and expression of yourself really. I do believe what's happening in this area in the northeast around the North York Moors there's, there's a reinvigoration of interest in the visual experience as exciting and as thrilling as it was in the, the days of the Stath Group.